Hi guys, my Sankaraj. Aro, azi apna ko paragat mo is uh, Bonnie and is a brilliant artist and painter. His Instagram handle is uh, Baba Bon. Aro, azi Bonnie more remote painting from the complete course. So Bonnie. Uh, a character to a character to actually amphitrite and amphitrite is a Greek goddess of uh, Greek goddess of the sea a Poseidon or wife as so they just I mean, start with some gram of which underwater again so my it would loosely base for it that are for Luna so so Kimandula is a complete Luna I am not I am so yeah, let's rewind this video and uh, check out no? how he started uh, doing it and how he completed it. Okay, okay check it out. So when we started this project, I had three ideas in my head, space, nature and water. Then Sankaraj liked the idea of water, so we decided to do that. So the concept is loosely based on amphitrite or amphitrite. I'm not really sure how to pronounce it, but she was the Greek goddess of the sea, also the wife of Poseidon. Now with that said, let's get to the technical part. While starting a mural, I always use a doodle grid to place my concept on the wall because I think it gives a bit more perfection than just freehanding it out. If you want a proper explanation on the doodle grid, comment down below. I will make a dedicated tutorial to that. After placing the concept on the wall, next comes the colors. I always try to work from light to dark on the colors because even if you mess up on the lighter colors, it's easier to cover it up with the darker ones. Also if you are working on a colored background like I have here, I recommend you to put a white base under your colors because trust me on this one because I learned it the hard way. It takes a lot of time to get a proper coverage if the base we have is not white. For the equipment here, I am using Brewster acrylic paint and Camlin matte medium. I didn't get any new brushes for this project because I have a lot of them lying around which I wanted to use. So the person you see here helping me out is Rishav Bordeloy. He's an amazing interior designer from Zorhat. Do check his work out. I will add links in my description below. So finding the right color for the borders on this project was a bit trickier than I expected because at first I thought about giving black but when I did that I wasn't quite happy with the result. So I decided to border the whole project out with the darkest version of the same color I'm using here. is coming to an end. I added a few more elements after doing the detailing part but I forgot to videotape them. So I will just show you in the end. Also let me introduce you to Sankara's course king of the house. Ciao ciao. So if you like this video do like share comment subscribe to my channel. I am coming up with more exciting content very soon so stay tuned. With that said enjoy the review.